This episode of See Tally Run is brought to you by Luva, Grandma's Marathon, and M Tech Results. <laughs> being Carrie Tellison and today we're doing in and out 100s so let's get after it I like to start this workout with a 15 to 20 minute warm-up and then end at the track when you get to the track I want you to sprint for 100 meters and then coast for 100 meters the in part is the sprint the out part is the coast and do this for 10 minutes take a break and do it again for another 10 minutes make sure to end your workout with a 15 to 20 minute cool down I love this workout because it teaches me how to switch paces up when I'm doing a 5K or a 10K. It's hard, but it makes me feel really fast and really fit afterwards. There's no excuses, peeps. If you don't have a track, go find a series of light poles and do one light pole on, one light pole off. Or if you don't have those, go find city blocks. And hey, if you're large and in charge like me, you can still do it too. Thanks for joining me for my in and out workout. Get after it. In and out, and in and out, in and out, and in and out. An in and out workout means you're gonna be the, and the out part is gonna be a. So you'll be out there for about an hour, roughly. Oh, how do I say that? Just alternate your pace, and use those landmarks to do that. How do I say that? <laughs> Let's go find a